How's it going, everybody? Sage the Collector back with Season 2 of Jordan Hunting. So, first episode, as anyone who has watched previous episodes of Jordan Hunting, <laughs> you'll see some familiar packs here. We've got our 90 Skybox, we got our 91 Hoops, we have our 93 Tops, we have our 95 Fleer, yeah, and our 95 Upper Deck Choice. So, lots of Jordans in these four. Only one Jordan in this pack. If for some reason this is the first time you're watching one of these Jordan hunting videos, there are 10 episodes in the, in the first season. So go, go back and watch those for sure. Took a couple months off, but we're back. It's hard to stop uh, busting old packs looking for Jordans. It's too fun. So we got a Phil Jackson. I think this might actually be a Phil Jackson rookie. It's either 89 or 90. I can I can never remember. But it's Phil, baby. He's going on the hit stack. <laughs> if you haven't uh, noticed by now, if you're not a longtime viewer of the channel, I am a Bulls fan. So, hey, there we go. Sean Kemp, rookie. Man, he's got little, little flex on him here. So this one's definitely <laughs> got some issues, but there you go. Kemp, rookie. Lechner, Danny Manning, Ron Harper, Cage, and Wes. So yeah, this 1990 set is pretty uh, pretty bare bones. No inserts, nothing. It's just just your base. So there's only one Jordan card. We'll see if we can find it in these six packs. Mark West. Orlando, well, these cards are just the best. Like, I mean, Skybox in the early 90s, it's, it's in my opinion, the best cards ever made. This is, I love the crazy color shapes in the background and the, and the fireball. Got a Keem. Keem the Dream. I'll put him on the hit stack, of course. Hall of Fame. Yeah, they started doing, like, these fireballs and, like, 93. I think it was 93 Skybox. The fireballs like got super crazy. Just love it. These packs are really hard to get into, though. All right, Randy Brewer, Derek McKee, Mookie, Reggie Miller, Ed Neely. Jerry Sloan. Oh, Sloan. R.I.P. Byron Irvin and Otis Smith. So, still no Jordan. We'll definitely have a higher chance of finding Jordan in those other sets because some of these sets he has like seven or eight cards. It's ridiculous. Versus only one in this. So, when you hit a Jordan skybox, it's a big deal. Not a huge deal, but a big deal. Oh boy, that one got crunched. Mark West, Michael Adams, Orlando. I'm getting a serious case of deja vu here. Spud Webb. Hey, it's Akeem the Dream again. <laughs> Ed Neely again. And Jerry Sloan again. All right, so that was definitely a deja vu pack. Ooh, come on. There we go. Got Isaiah, TR Dunn, Sam, hey, BJ Armstrong, Jay Humphreys, Scotty Brooks, Tom Tolbert, oh, Delaney Rudd, and Jack Haley. Boy, a lot of these are getting crunched. All right, final pack of 1990 hoops, or skybox, not hoops. Let's see if we can get lucky. Rolando Blackman, coolest name ever in the NBA. Chris Dudley, Rod Higgins, got a checklist. Oh, wrong bowl, Will Purdue. <laughs> Terry Davis, John Williams, Danny Young, 
and Grant Long. So, no Jordan out of 90 Skybox. On to 91 Hoops, where there are 97 Jordans. There are so many Jordans in this set, it's crazy. So if we don't hit a Jordan in these six packs, it'll be a miracle. Scott Skiles, of course I just jinxed myself. Derek Coleman, Byron Scott, Rick Adelman, The Glove. Hey, it's Phil again. Horace. Got David Robinson and Dennis Rodman on the same card. Rebound leaders. Oh, look at that. Robinson beat Rodman. Wow. Larry Nance, Kenny Skywalker, and Paul Wested. So, on to pack number two. And as hard as 90 Skybox packs are to get into is how easy 91 Hoops packs are to get hard to get into. They just, they fall off. I like it. All right, Magic. I didn't show the backs of the Skybox cards. Oh, maybe maybe I did on one of them. Magic definitely goes on the hit stack. Ugh, gross. It's got Bill Lambert on it. It's got to go for a ride. Clyde the Glide, put him on the hit stack. Hall of Famer. KJ Moses. Hey, there's our first Jordan. Nice. I love this card. And it looks pretty good. Corners are good. Edges are good. Centering is pretty good. So it's a little off top to bottom. But first Jordan. We're on the board, baby. Sam Mitchell. Dwayne. Moses again. Jeff Hornacek. Yeah, like I said, there are like, like maybe seven Jordans in this set. At least, I'd say. It's crazy. David Robinson. Eh, we'll put him on the hit stack. Early 90s. Ooh, Dominique. There we go. Love me some Meek. Ricky Pierce. Miami Heat. Minute. John Williams. Rodney McRae, Ron Harper, and the Milwaukee Bucks. Got Patrick Ewing, Sidney, Gerald Glass. I don't remember him. Hey, you got Carl Malone. Kurt Rambis, look at that. Now that's a card, baby. <laughs> hey, Chicago Bulls. Oh, I miss the Bulls. Oh, what a team. What a team. Hey, it's David Robinson and Meek again. Deja Vu. We're getting some Deja Vu packs here so far. Sam Vincent Otis. Okay, Craig Hodges. Kevin Willis. Man, that dude was a beast. Man, lots of flipping here. James Buddha Edwards. Hey, Timmy Hardaway. Yeah, I'll put him on. It's it's an all-star card, but it's Tim Hardaway. It's going on the hit stack. Got Larry Bird. NBA yearbook. Charles Smith and Pooh Richardson. So, final pack. We've only found one Jordan out of here. Got Sedale. Larry Brown. Oh man, look how young Larry Brown is. Holy cow. Sidney Green. Darnell Valentine. Oh, Jerry Sloan again. AC. That's a sweet card. Robert Parrish and Buck Williams. Chuck Daly, Bad Boys Coach, Harvey Grant, Elvin and 
John, I assume assist leaders. Oh no, steals. Look at that. And Reggie Miller. So, only one Jordan out of uh, 91 hoops. Now we are on to 93 tops. And there are a few Jordans in this set. And basically, nothing too exciting. But you're looking for the base Jordan in the gold parallel. You don't want... There are black gold cards in here, but they're separate inserts that don't really have too many good players in them and there isn't a jordan so these are a little sticky so here's the here's the base card looking on the back got jeff malone danny ferry hey vlade bo kimball and then here's our first tops gold you'll see it's stamped with the gold and our first tops gold is doug west and there's alonzo Looking fly. <laughs> Call R.I.P. Cliff Robinson. Vernon Maxwell is stuck to Reggie Miller. Brian Stith. So, first pack down. And Jordan's base card in this set is actually pretty cool. And I still have never hit a gold version of it, so... That is my goal. Uh, oh, there we go. Hey, it's Tim Hardaway again. Got a Shack highlight. Googs. Weatherspoon. Dawkins. Gerald Wilkins. Hey, there's Alonzo. I don't often get to put Alonzo on the hit stack. Ah, for Big J's sake, I'll put Alonzo on the hit stack. Olden Polonese. All right, two packs down. Jordan's still hiding. Yeah, he's got like uh, there's like a 50 points club. He's got a scoring leader in here. All right, looks like we got a Topps Gold, a Muggsy. There's the one of those 50 point clubs. So Jordan's got one of these. Mark Eaton. Man, that dude was huge. Spud Webb, Scotty Brooks, Stockton, Danny Ferry, Kimball, Bryant again, Sean Green. All right, so not no uh, no Jordan, not even any Pippen. Definitely light on the Bulls. All right, our top's gold is Thurl Bailey. Hey, there's Charles, Tops All-Star. Orlando. Joe Dumars. Derek Coleman. Tim Kempton. Man, I don't remember him. Brent Price. Anthony Peelers. Wow. Two more packs. Jordan, where are you? Hmm. This pack isn't splitting like it normally does. All right. Our top's gold is Anthony Advent. Avent? Okay. Ooh, we got back-to-back -back top top's gold. Larry Stewart. Neek. KJ Sam Mitchell. Clarence Weatherspoon. Ugh, John Starks. Get out of here, John Starks. Muggsy and Lafonso Ellis. All right, final pack. Jordan, <laughs> you're going to show yourself. Now is the time. Oh, spoiler alert. Spoiler alert. I'm, gonna, I'm, I'm keeping it off camera in case that didn't show up. And I can't get it out of the pack. All right, let's see if I can do this. Nope, I did that wrong. What? What am I doing wrong? I was doing that fairly well up until now. Got BJ, Johnny Newman, Pooh, Ramil, Kevin Lynch. 
We got a Topps Gold Mark Price All Star. Got a Buck Bill, Ed Pinkney, Derek McKee, and in case anyone didn't see it, Blood Owl. There's the Jordan. And it was on the back, so I'm guessing the corners are probably ding. This one's a little dinged, but not bad. The other ones aren't too bad. Centering's a little off. But there it is. Jordan with the crazy shorts. Not the tops gold, just the regular base, but success. Jordan number two. All right, now we are on to 95, 96 Fleer. And the good thing about these, there are a lot of Jordans, but you get one of these Flare hard, Hardwood cards on, at the top of every pack. So we're hoping one of these is a Jordan. Ah, David Robinson. But these are just cool. Thick cards, 27 of them. Anyway, that goes on the hit stack for sure. And then, what is this here? Franchise Futures, Dikembe Mutombo. That's actually, it's a cool looking card. Got some foil. All right, so that's cool. Got a Dikembe insert. Nice. All right, now we get into the crazy cards and man, this set is just weird looking. It, the base cards vary greatly. Like this is the one kind of design and you're like, all right, it's a little, it's a little busy, but it's colorful. Got Terry Cummins, got Mahmoud, David Benoit. Got three cards stuck to each other. So just a regular checklist. Got Clyde the Glide on Houston. Eh, we'll put him on the hit stack. It's still Clyde the Glide. Robert Pack, got Googs. Stuck to a couple people here. Hey, there's Scotty. Yeah, th these cards, this, I don't know. Anyone, anytime a design puts a bunch of text on the front, yeah, I'm not a big fan. I kind of, the colors in the background are, are crazy 90s, but overall, the design is a little too busy. All right, we got Todd Day. Got a Hersey. Hersey is stuck to Andrew Lang. Terrell Brandon and Joe Dumars is stuck to BJ Armstrong. All right, so got a Pippin. That's not bad. And we got that Dikembe insert, which was cool. And our hardwood leader is Mitch Richmond. All right, so I think this is an insert set too. Yep, three of 13. Oh, this is one of those, yeah, the reversible cards. So you got Shaq on one side and the dream on the other. So that's cool. Unique card. Oh, now we're into the ugly ones. So some of the cards, I think it's East Coast teams or something like that, are these with this the hideous background <laughs> and with all this just random text. It, this is one of the ugliest designs ever made. It's just hideous. I mean, who wants to see that? <laughs> It's just, oh, it's the thing of nightmares. And Rex Walters. Hey, Dominique in a Celtics uniform. Scary. Got Grant Long, Tyrone Hill, Grant Hill. Hey, there he is. This is the first time I've hit Jordan out of this set. Nice. Corners aren't too bad. Centering, I don't know, it's hard to tell. <laughs> How can you tell if it's centered or not? There's just so much going on. Actually, the back looks really centered. That's pretty close. So, there you go. I don't even know if I have this card in my collection, much less pulled it from a pack. So, very exciting. Nice. Okay, Derek McKee, got Muggsy, and finally, Byron Scott. All right, playing with house money, pulled the Jordan. I don't know what other Jordans are in here, other than the hardwood court. I think there are a couple inserts, two or three inserts he can be in. 
All right, our hardwood is Carl, the mailman Malone. Hey, Pippin, it's one of the inserts. Who's gonna be on the back? Kemp, okay. Two of 13. Nice, nice, I don't think I have this card either, so. Definitely, we're hitting cards for the for the PC today. Love it. Got Rodney Rogers, Christian Leitner. Got Jamal, who is stuck at two. Kenny Smith. Like, of the three designs, this one's probably the best, because they kind of, at least, the text on the front is corralled in little circles. It's not just all over the place, but... Still. Mm. Got Sean Elliott. Lafonso Ellis is stuck to blue. Got the glove. Th I take it back. This is the best design. This is actually a normal design. Like, I don't like vertical text like that, but, I mean, that's actually a normal design. I kind of dig this design, because you got the colors matching the jerseys. So... Spud, Dale Davis, got the Plastic Man, Sleepy Sam, and Latrell Sprewell. All right, final pack of 95 Falir. Last chance to get a Hardwood Jordan. Come on. And our Hardwood is not a Jordan. Gary Payton. All right, we got this. What is this? Double double, Vlade. Interesting insert. I kind of dig that. All right, Jason Kidd. I think, yeah, his rookie was ninety four, ninety five. So this is a second year kid. Got the dream again. Now nah, I'll put him on the hit stack. Even the late dream is still a dream. We right, got Dale Ellis stuck to Antoine Carr. Got a checklist stuck to Mario. J.R. Reed, Mark Jackson. There goes that man. Mookie Blaylock. Got Detlef Will Perdue. <laughs> uh, Del Curry Sr. and Craig Elo. So, that was a successful year. And now we are on to the final year. 95 choice. And I think there are several Jordans in here too. So, oh boy. Got a little sticky cards here. So, I think this is actually the silver silver parallel <laughs> it's actually just dull gray parallel of felton spencer got a mashburn scouting or no mashburn joan howard scouting report All right, this might this might be a little be a little while sticky avery johnson no all right and what is this photo gallery Mark Jackson? No, that's just a regular subset. Sonic, Sonic's Boom. Dino. Got Mark Jackson again. Come on, who are you stuck? Oh, you're not stuck to anybody. Greg Anthony. And, oh, I forgot the, the rookies in this set are all the dreamy guys on the step ladders. Oh, I love it. <laughs> I mean, nowadays, they just put up a huge black tarp and they tell people to, you know, make a bunch of crazy poses. Back in the 90s, man, they just put a step ladder there and they told you to look sexy. <laughs> I just love the glow. Oh, that's just the best. Love it. This... Busting these packs is worth it just to look at the rookie glamour shots. Ah, oh, so good, so good. All right, we're back to these crazy foil packs. Hey, it's Tony. Let's have to do a little break in here, sorry. Got Tony. Nice. 
Players Club. All right. I got a Tony's Tony PC, so that's going on the hit stack for sure. Supersonics, Sean Kemp, Reggie. Hey, there you go. Got a United Effort, Chicago Bulls. Pippin on the front. Nice, nice. His stats when he took over the team and our glamour rookie is Andrew DeClerco, whoever that is. Oh, we got back-to-back -back glory rookies. Corey Alexander. Got Byron Scott on the Grizzlies. Lawrence Moten stuck to... Hey, Luke. All right. Let's see what sexy rookies we can get in this pack. If you're not going to pull a Jordan, you might as well pull a sexy rookie. Got a Players Club parallel of Kenny cutting that hoop down. Lamont Murray. Avery again. Damon Stoudemire. Got Penny. Man, we didn't hit any pennies yet. Grandmama. Brian Williams is stuck to Sedale. Clifford Rozier. Terry Davis. Jalen Rose. And Cliff Robinson. Can't remember when Jalen's rookie year was. Definitely wasn't that, but. All right, halfway through. Jordan still eluding us. Got to finish on a high note here. All right, we got a Players Club of the Admiral. Top 40 defenders. Carl Malone. Reggie. Oh, here we go. We got one of these. <laughs> Crash the game. So you got one of these and it give you, gives you a date. And then you had to watch the game on that date to see if he achieved a certain goal. So you needed 10 assists or 10 rebounds on March 19th. And then you send this card in. You got a free Crash the Game card. And if you're going to get a card, I'm guessing Jason Kidd probably got 10 assists on that night. So... I'm sure I'm putting down below whether he achieved his goal or not. I'm interested to find out. I'm excited. Something to look forward to. All right, we got Penny Photo Gallery. Got Donald Royal. Come on. Come on, cards. Let go. <laughs> oh, ooh, we're getting into the glamour shots. Here we go. Brian Stitt. And we got our David Vaughn and Kurt Thomas. Love it. Oh, three in a row, Michael Finley. Oh, he doesn't want to go on the top step. He's going on the third step. <laughs> oh, it's just too good. All right, penultimate pack of Jordan Hunting. Season 2, Episode 1. Got one of those silver. Got a Players Club silver of Felton Spencer. All right, let's do a little pre-crack here. Rick Smits. Hmm. Got Damon scouting report. Got Orlando Magic. That looks like Tyrone Hill. Man, these are sticky. Carl Malone. Vernon Maxwell. Brent Berry. Hey, there's Damon Stoudemire. Brian Shaw. And Clyde the Glide, gliding in. All right, final pack. Jordan, where are you, buddy? There you go. 
A silver of KG. I think this is actually a rookie of KG. And a Players Club version. Horribly off-center, but... Got a silver Players Club. That's pretty cool. Nice, nice. Pretty sure that's KG, rookie. If it's not, I will have corrected myself in the lower third of the video, but... I believe it is. Come on. There's just a lot of garbage subsets in this set. Right, Avery Johnson. We got a Rick Fox. Hey, Greg Ostertag. Vern Fleming. Gary Trent. And Charles Barkley. So, not, uh, not much going on there. Except for the KG Rookie. So, that was pretty cool. KG Rookie. Got a Pip. Got a Kukoc. Carl Malone. Jordan, definitely going up there. Pippin, maybe, maybe. Yeah, that was a cool card. I'll put that up there. Jordan, yeah, yeah. Man, that's a cool card. Love this card. Jordan. Magic. Sean Kemp and uh, Phil Jackson. So, only uh, three Jordans, but... I mean, that's not bad. Three Jordans is better than zero Jordans. So we got the uh, got the 91 Hoops Jordan All-Star. Got the 93 Tops Jordan. Got the 95 Fleer Jordan. We got this cool franchise Futures Dikembe foil insert. Then we got a Silver Players Club KG Rookie. So I'd say that was a success. At the very least, it was fun. I paid about $28 for the packs, and the cards ended up being worth around $24, so not terrible. We hit three Jordans, so that was cool. And as always with these Jordan hunting videos, we're not hunting for monsters. These packs are very low risk, but also very low reward. The reward is having fun busting packs, which is getting harder and harder to do these days without taking out a second mortgage on your house. Well, that'll do it for episode one of season two of Jordan hunting. I'm so happy to be doing these again. They are so much fun. If you liked the video, please like, comment, and subscribe to the channel, and hit that bell button to be notified when I post episode two. Thanks for watching, everybody. Tune in next time for another basketball break.